Apple's real opinion of cryptocurrencies has just been revealed, and Shiba Inu holders might be completely shocked about what we just found out. Whether or not this is something that we should be bothered about and what effect it could have on Shiba Inu are what we'll be discussing in today's video. So make sure to keep watching this video until the end. Disclaimer. Starting with something a lot more local, the Shiba Inu community has been quite busy as we wait for the launch of Shibarium. There are probably some people in the planning stage of a project that they plan to build on Shibarium. And there are definitely others who have been amassing Shiba Inu tokens in hopes that the platform launch will pump prices. But more recently, people have also been signing petitions. Well, to be more specific, they have been signing just one petition. A petition to get Binance to list Bone. The petition explains that Bone is designed to give Sheep Army the opportunity to vote on upcoming proposals, which also means that the more Bone tokens a person has, the more weight their votes have. Plus, it also makes it possible for people to serve as delegators and validators on the upcoming Shibarium. So the community considers Bone very important to them and would love to have the biggest exchange platform in the world have the token in its lineup. This listing would make Bone a lot more valuable to more people, which would definitely be great. But the community is not just asking that Binance list Bone, they are also asking for the exchange to support the ShibaSwap ecosystem. For those who don't know, you today mentions that ShibaSwap, a next-generation DeFi platform, offers users the ability to provide liquidity, stake, and swap tokens to gain returns through its passive income reward system. The platform also gives members of the Sheep Army access to upcoming NFTs and portfolio tracking tools to make navigating the crypto world more intuitive. So Binance listing ShibaSwap would be huge for Shiba Inu. And if this happens, it would make Binance the first traditional brokerage to support the ShibaSwap ecosystem. Now, considering the community's previous successes with getting exchanges to list a Shiba Inu token, the most significant being the Robinhood listing, many are confident that this petition will be a success. At the time of recording this video, the recent Binance listing petition has about 1,000 votes, as the community awaits a response from Binance. While we wait for the response, you might want to consider the fact that if Binance ends up listing Bone, the price of the token could get a significant boost. So now that it is not listed would be the best time to buy Bone, don't you think? This isn't financial advice though. Now to the issue with Apple. Bitcoin dedicated account Bitcoin Archive recently posted something interested on Twitter. Here is what he wrote. Just in. Apple considered cryptocurrencies a Ponzi and deliberately made App Store approvals vague and difficult. Ex-head of Apple's App Store. So, according to Bitcoin Archive, an ex-top Apple employee just revealed that Apple has never been a fan of crypto. Now, while some might consider this shocking information, if you think back on recent events, it might not be all that shocking to you. Sometime last year, I made a video where I talked about the restrictions that Apple had put in place for exchange apps. They made it very difficult for exchange apps to gain approval to be on the App Store by laying out criteria that some might consider ridiculous. But what exactly is the implication of Apple's stake on the crypto market? Well, most people seem to think that Apple is the one on the losing end here. One Twitter user in the comments section at willai2199 wrote this, Apple is big, but not that big that they can survive missing a generational shift like crypto. Current and future Gen N will just go elsewhere. It is obvious that this person believes that Apple's position on cryptocurrencies will put them at a disadvantage down the line if this doesn't change. Speaking of things changing, another Twitter user, at KK underscore Cryptor, seems to believe that Twitter will be the one to help Apple to change things. So basically, they mentioned that Twitter has to first integrate crypto, and then Apple will have no choice but to follow the trend. If this is true, it could mean that Apple might be changing its tune soon. Remember that in a previous video, we talked about how Twitter had already started making moves towards a crypto payments integration. So if that Twitter user is right and a move by Twitter towards crypto acceptance would make Apple more accepting, then it might be happening soon. But there is also the possibility that the powers that be in Apple would decide to stick to their guns. Anyway, if you found this really valuable, please drop a comment and share this video with friends. It really helps with the YouTube algorithm thus helping me to keep increasing the quality of the videos. Now, moving on to something more local, it looks like the launch of Shibarium could be delayed again. At least, that's what some people think that Shitoshi's recent actions insinuate. 
But before we get into that, this channel has a daily giveaway of 100,000 sheep. For a chance to participate in this giveaway, all you have to do is subscribe to this channel, like this video, and leave a comment below hashtag Shiba Inu. Good luck! Also, there's now a membership option on this channel. Becoming a member gives you access to a private group chat with me where we get to discuss crypto gems, finances, and success. If you are interested, hit the membership button. Apparently, Shaitoshi has cancelled the message in his bio that talked about putting Shibarium in a heart-shaped box with a bow. And as you must remember, many people interpreted that message to mean that Shibarium will be launched on Valentine's. But now that the message has been taken down, it kind of looks like Shibarium's launch date has been moved. People are even more agitated by the fact that nothing was put in place to replace the message. On the other hand though, it could just be that Shaitoshi is trying to clear the way for a more concrete Shibarium launch announcement. It could actually mean that the launch of Shibarium is just around the corner. I'm pretty sure that every single Shiba Inu holder right now desperately hopes that the latter is true. That Shaitoshi's move means that Shibarium is about to be launched, not that it has been delayed. After all the delays that happened last year, I don't think that the Shiba Inu community would be particularly excited about more delays. But then again, we have to remember the fact that the dev team hasn't yet explicitly announced a launch date. So this might be a sign for us to contain our expectations in order not to get disappointed. What do you think though? Do you think the dev team has hit a roadblock and has to delay the launch of Shibarium? Or are they just about ready to launch Shibarium? Please share your thoughts in the comments section below. One last thing before we call it a day here. A recent transaction on the Ethereum network has got crypto enthusiasts wondering what exactly is going on. An anonymous user recently sent a massive 20 Ethereum gas fee on the Ethereum network. And this transaction is considered one of the largest gas fees recorded on the Ethereum network after the 2021 bull market. So it's definitely worth considering. What's even more perplexing is the fact that the average transaction fee on Ethereum is way lower at less than a dollar. So a 20 Ethereum gas fee is extremely unusual. In fact, some people considered that it might have been a mistake. But the Ethereum network has continued to function normally with no technical issues observed. So that's out of the discussion. But there's still no explanation for what happened. Whatever the case though, I think it is safe to say that a slip up like this could never happen with Shibarium. And this is not even about me trying to be unnecessarily optimistic. Research has shown that Shiba Inu is one of the safest crypto projects out there. And if the dev team has managed to build a crypto project that is very safe, we can also expect them to make Shibarium as safe as possible. Of course, considering that Shibarium hasn't been launched yet, we cannot say for sure. But please, tell us in the comments section if you agree. With that, we come to the end of this video. If you enjoyed the video, then please like this video and don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section. This really helps me with the YouTube algorithm. Also, please share this video to as many people as possible. Let's get this news out there.